luggage of Matsuris, two of the top riders in the world, certainly on the factory Kawasaki's great boats, but they have a great team behind them, led by some of the best technicians in the sport. In any form of motorsports, there are three key factors for success. A good machine, great drivers or riders, and a crew chief that ensures that everyone and everything is doing their job. Many are of the opinion that Team Kawasaki's chief technician, Darren Hedlund, is the catalyst that has solidified great riders, jet skis, and crew members into the most dominant PwC race team of all time. For Darren, the skills and knowledge required for this task isn't something read in a shop manual or heard in a classroom. More than anything, when I was younger, my parents taught me how to win. I mean, I grew up on a family farm, and, and that was a lot like racing, believe it or not, when you're growing up raising turkeys, believe it or not. And um, in racing, there's really nothing that, uh, that could ever replace hard work. Um, it's work, work, and then work some more. But the, I think the biggest mistake people make nowadays is they don't take care of the people that take care of them because without good people, you can't win. I mean, there's been a lot of race teams in the last four or five years that have two and three times the size of our budget that we whip pretty handily. And um, it just, it, that's what racing's all about. You hear, it, you hear about it all the time in NASCAR and all the other sports. You hear about it more and more. Even the best people will flounder without proper communication. One of Darren's biggest challenges is to assist team manager Joe Heim in keeping all of the team members on the same page, so to speak, working together and moving forward. You can't sit on your laurels in racing. And if you do, and you know, my dad told me when I was younger that you have to change something every day. And if you don't, you fall behind. You know, he was successful in racing you know, back when I was very young, and, and I wanted to be better than that. You know? I love what I do. I mean that that in itself. I mean that anybody that knows me very well knows that I love doing what I do. And, and I guess when you get up in the morning and you want to go back and do it again, that's a, to me that's a good thing. Maybe that, that can be too much of a good thing at some point, obviously. But um, I just I love to win. I love to win races, and it's a huge feeling of accomplishment when you build something that beats everybody else's. It's you know it, that that fuels a a huge fire to spend a lot of time doing that.